What's up, what's up, what's up? Okay, honestly, I don't know why I try to do something different. Um, because I usually sing to you guys when I come onto my vlog. So let's do that. Let's go back to doing what I usually do. <laughs> hey guys, hey, it's Kira here, and welcome back to another vlog. It is a Thursday, you guys, and I'm working from home. I usually don't work from home on Thursdays, but it was just one of those days. <laughs> so I'm home right now. I am sitting in my office, as you guys can tell, maybe, maybe not, but I'm in my office. I'm working, but also like <laughs> not right now. But um, God, that was like an ugly wink. So I am super excited, as you guys know, because we are having a girl, <laughs> which is so crazy. And maybe I'll like talk about it later because um, I like feel like I want to like get deep into the conversation. Um, but yeah, we're having a girl. If you guys have not seen our announcement, you can go on my Instagram and see it. Um, maybe I'll even like put it here. We'll see. Um, so yeah, we're having a girl, which is so crazy. I did not think that would happen like i just knew we were gonna have a boy like i was just like gonna be this boy mom and own it and be the only girl in the household but obviously god had other plans <laughs> so and that's okay because we're super excited um but yeah i just got super excited with like getting back vlogging obviously announcing that we're pregnant because we had i mean we've been holding on to that secret for a while now and so i'm like i don't know i just feel like so good i feel excited for what's to come and like really keep you guys like informed and like just I don't know keeping you guys disengaged this whole time so I've been doing a little bit of like outreach and um with different like maternity and baby brands and I'm super excited because I've been getting a lot of yeses of course I've been getting no's which is totally fine like I've been getting a lot of yeses which is making like me like super excited like I can barely talk as you guys can see so that's what I'm working on right now I'm obviously catching up on some vlogs here let me like i don't know why i do that so on my work computer right now but i'm catching up on my favorite vlogs right now and then i'm also picking out some outfits with pink blush they are collabing with me and if you guys want to see like i am on page what page am i on i'm on page 23 look at that 23 out of 67 so i still have some ways to go but i have 47 things saved in my um like on my like wish list here so yeah i have to pick a few outfits from them and i'll be collabing with them so i'm excited for that and so that's what i kind of been sitting here doing is like catching up on some youtube vlogs that for my favorite influencers and then um yeah trying to find some fits 47 is ridiculous. Obviously, I'm not gonna get 47 fits. They sent me like a gift card and so I'll probably be able to get like three or four fits and so nearing that down, it's going to be like, Jesus, like I don't know what that looks like. Um, yeah, I'm super excited. A lot of great collabs coming up. Um, and I can't wait to show you guys like, ah, I'm back. Like, I feel like I keep saying this or have been saying it quite a minute, like for a while now, but like I'm officially back. Like I feel so excited to be vlogging again and like, and I hope you guys are excited too, cause it's gonna be crazy. Lots of like, I don't know, just lots of things to do obviously, like to get prepared for baby. Um, and obviously like, I don't want this to just be about like the baby. Um, and I hope people understand that and feel that. Obviously there is gonna be a lot of content and things around baby because like, that's like my life right now. I'm a mom obviously of two kids, soon to be two kids and so, um, you know like there's different parts of me like i'm a mom i'm a wife obviously creator i'm a working mom at that so like there's just a lot of different avenues here and so i hope you guys like feel connected in some way but of course always let me know what you want to see for me so anyways that's my little spill so let's get the day started hey guys hey it's friday super excited we love fridays um i'm getting ready to make a vanilla matcha I used this Chamberlain brand, um, Chamberlain coffee brand, I think by M Emma Chamberlain, is that her name? <laughs> I like her, it's, it's really like I blanked on her name, um, but yeah, I'm getting ready to make a matcha, um, I'm trying to get back into my matcha game, like, I don't know, like, I kind of like 
the beginning of my first trimester i just could not really do like coffee and like matcha like i was just not about it and i still do coffee like i do coffee now but just not as often as i used to so i'm trying to get back into my matcha um i made a matcha yesterday while anthony was in the kitchen making his coffee and like i like completely forgot how to make matcha i was like babe what did i put in it because like i obviously this is vanilla but i like would add things to it just to make it like pop a little bit and i tell you like while i was making it i was just like oh my god i'm forgetting something i'm forgetting something and it finally registered that i was forgetting brown sugar afterwards and so it wasn't the best matcha i made but we're back today i'm really excited so we're gonna make a bomb matcha today um <coughs> like have this little cough or whatever um i need a straw i need a straw so so i was gonna go um work from a coffee shop today and then I looked at my to-do list that I make. I try to make my to-do list like bright and early in the morning before my day starts, or at least the night before, then I just know like what's happening today. Um, so I looked at my list today and I was like, you know what, I better not. I should just stay at home. And so literally the first thing I need to do is reach out to the guy who does our taxes. Um, so I need to reach out to him and like schedule our appointment. So that's adulting, so number one. <laughs> um, I need, I need to record a testimonial for my girl Taylor, aka Cloud 10 Photography. Um, if you guys didn't know, she takes majority of like our photos. Like I've been taking photos of her like since I first moved out here, which is like 20, what was that, 2018, 2019, 2018, yeah. So I'm doing a testimonial for Taylor. She asked me to do one, so I gotta do that. I need to book my massage um, because I, my mom gave me like a free like massage for my birthday which is back in november we are in the month of april and i was like girl just go ahead and use it so i need to do that um i need to do something for work um i'm so glad i only have one meeting today because like it's weird having a whole bunch of meetings on a friday because i'm just like what like is no one not really trying to work today <laughs> so i need to do something for for work and i do have a meeting this morning just one um i need to work on our baby registry for a baby girl so I know this is gonna like take some time but it's still on my list to like start doing that i won't like wait to the last minute when people are really starting to ask for it so i want to start working on that um and side note side note like we don't want anything pink <laughs> like no for real like ugh, i hate that i'm like this because i'm not like trying to be super neutral with her like because chirpy got like some color and like i totally get it he's a kid but like the bright pinks please guys like not for me <laughs> not for baby girl so you need to work on baby registry. I need to fold clothes. I wash all of them, which is great. I try to wash all the clothes through the throughout the week. So I'll do like a load this day, or maybe two loads this day. Um, so by the time the weekend comes, like I don't have to just worry about like washing clothes and just folding all weekend. And so I need to fold clothes um, before tomorrow because we're having like hopefully like a little family day. I need to clean out our fridge. So obviously I cook, I really cook Sunday through Thursday. Um, and Friday mornings too, like I'll make breakfast or whatever. But I need to clean out the fridge with like all the leftovers, what we're not gonna probably eat for lunch. And so I clean out the fridge <laughs> today. I need to do that. I need to do dishes because obviously once I clean out the fridge, I'm gonna have all these like extra like tubbleware and stuff. And so I need to empty, empty the dishwasher and like load up my dishwasher with that stuff. Um, I need to vacuum our living room because every week my god trip puts a whole bunch of crumbs in our couch on the floor so i need to do that and then i need to clean our bathroom so yeah as you guys can see me trying to go to a coffee shop did not make any sense today so i will be at home um but yeah that is my to-do list and so i don't know like i'm so blessed and grateful that i get to work from home um a lot of days of the week and so friday just happens to be one of those days and um you know, nothing crazy is going on at work too much, and so I'm glad I get to, like, work and knock out stuff for work and also be able to, like, prep and clean my house. Because uh, I just, I don't know, I try to do all that before the weekend really hits. I don't have to, like, be in the house all weekend. Like, like to, like, try to go out and stuff and, like, be with my family. And so this is, like, a one weekend in a long time where, like, nothing's happening, which makes me so freaking excited. Because um, March was literally crazy. Like, every month, I mean, sorry, every weekend... There was something going on in march and so like i was like oh my god like we it was fun obviously we loved the month of march <laughs> like whether it was like a friend's birthday or something or anthony was just like out of town i think i told you guys he went to aruba for a week and so like it's just like we weren't all together there was always something planned so 
I'm excited for weekends where like absolutely nothing is planned. Um, and like we get to have a family day, like me and Anthony were like, let's just do something with the family, like us three. And so we're gonna take full advantage of that and like just be tomorrow, whatever that looks like. And so I'm super excited to be with the boys. Um, oh my God, I just realized like, I just realized that I won't be um, able to stay be with the boys like months or now. Like that's like my thing. Like I'm like going out with the boys or whatever. And like once she's here, like I won't be able to say that. So. Well, wow, bittersweet moment. <laughs> I'm gonna have to like, I was gonna have to use up that whole phrase for a while now. Just beat the boys, beat the boys until I can't anymore. So anyways, well, let's get into making this matcha. I'm hoping I make it right today because I have all my ingredients. So I just need to do really well and make this right now. <laughs> I don't know why that I think this is like the coolest thing, but our freezer makes two different kinds of ice. So we have like the big cube ice and then we have like the small tiny ice. Obviously me and Anthony just always get the big cube for the most part, but still really cool. I didn't know like freezers did this until we got this. So I just love this about <laughs> our freezer. Okay, now the test of all tests. Does it taste good? Let's see. Oh, y'all, this is like a complete difference <laughs> from yesterday. Yesterday, I was like, wait, what's happening? Yesterday, I literally like was like, what is this? This is so terrible. But today, your girl did so much better. This is so good. Oh my God, I think I'm back to my matches. Like I did that and so I'm super excited to be like back. Yes, I'm so excited. Oh. If you guys don't like matcha, okay? Because I know it's like a hit or miss because I didn't like matcha at first too. If you don't like matcha, I highly recommend. I know I just showed you guys this, but I highly recommend this Chamberlain Coffee Vanilla Matcha. Um, I don't know. It's just so good to me. Like, you really taste the vanilla. And I think you all know, by, know this by now, but I'm a huge vanilla girly. Like, the scents I wear have vanilla in it. I love anything like vanilla flavored, like, but this is just so good. Look at this bug outside of our window. This is like, ugh, this is why, I, like, I have like a love hate for spring because like the bugs. Like, there's so many bugs, and of course, like our backyard is like filled with all these freaking trees. Like, it's just like, ugh, oh my god, I hate this. 
Okay, so I'm about to make a grilled cheese and some ramen noodles. Don't judge, no judgment here. Um, like that's literally all I've been craving. You can, even, you can even ask Anthony, like I've been eating this almost like every single day. I don't know why for like lunch. Um, so she and I'm like obviously at home and it's just so good to me. Like that's all I want is like a grilled cheese and <laughs> some ramen noodles. And of course I use like my favorite cheese right now or honestly probably forever in my life. Um, it's the white American cheese. I only have one more slice left. Um, so I'm gonna make my grilled cheese, eat my ramen noodles, and then just watch Grace and Frankie for a little bit. Cause I've been working very hard this morning cleaning. Um, so I'm gonna take like a quick little break. But yeah, I don't know if you guys can tell, I sound a little bit stuffy, which is so annoying. It's just so annoying because like, I think I have allergies and I've never had allergies before in my life, like ever. But I heard like it's something that can come later, like as you become, you know, more of an adult, as you mature. So I like, at first I thought I was sick and I was blaming Anthony all the way because he has really bad allergies. And I thought like, obviously he was sick too. But yeah, he just has allergies. And I'm like, oh my God, like there's no way I can have allergies. So I'm trying to figure it out. And of course being pregnant, I don't even know if I can take like Zyrtec or anything. I need to do some research, but like there's only certain things you're allowed to take and I don't think I can take Zyrtec. So I gotta figure it out. My phone's ringing. Okay, so I just got the notification that Trips package is here from Lalo. I hope I'm saying that right. I don't know, it's L-A-L-O. Lalo, right? So they um, sent over a really cute table and two chairs to go to the table for Trip. I'm so excited because I know it's gonna be so freaking cute. I got to choose the color and everything. And I'm so excited to be partnering with them. Um, what's so crazy is like, as like Trip got older, like I knew like I wanted him to have a table, like just to kind of like play with. We're usually downstairs for the most part, like he'll go to his room, but like obviously, you know, for playing or going to sleep, whatever, his clothes are in there. It's a room, guys. <laughs> so, but anyways, like we're usually downstairs and like we spend a lot of time downstairs and it's like, I don't know, I just want him to have something somewhere to sit, like whether he wants to color, eat a snack there, or whatever. And so Lalo um, actually, like, you know, they sent over a table for him. So I'm super, super excited. And I really wanted to put it together before he gets here. Um, so like, I have some time, like it's only, I think it's like 1.30. I usually pick him up around like 4.30, 5 o'clock. So I'm hoping I can put this together by myself because Anthony's not here right now. <laughs> so y'all, I'm so excited. Let's like get this table. <laughs> Let's get This is the spot I thought would be best for a trips table. Anthony's probably not gonna be in love with this. And like, I understand why. It's taking up like a lot of space. <laughs> but just for now, this is where it's gonna be. It's so freaking cute. Trip is going to like freaking love this. I just know he is. And also they sent over a whole bunch of coloring sheets. Um, they're like dinosaur theme. And they have like these little stickies on the back so they can stick to the table. So Trip can like color. I'm really trying here, you guys. I'm really trying, but. So freaking cute. I love it. I mean, it's not about me. Trip's gonna love it. That's all that matters. Mommy got some coloring pages for us, okay? Ooh, that's what is dinosaurs. just woke up you guys <laughs> and we're having a girl 
let's go how do you really feel about us like having a girl i'm excited man i didn't know how i'd feel about it to be honest yeah uh well i just didn't know i feel about I, well no i felt like we were having a boy though so i felt yeah. like we were having a boy and i just knew i was gonna have another boy you remember when you told me like oh i don't think i have any X chromosomes in me. <laughs> <laughs> and I actually believe you. I don't believe you. Yeah. No, I said, I said, I was told I don't have any X chromosomes. <laughs> Which is ridiculous. Like, who would tell me that? <laughs> like, there are none in me. And, so and here we are. Was, here we are with a girl on the way. Yeah. We have what the, that, the typical American dream that we heard about. Yeah. When you get the boy and the girl, it's gonna be fun. You have a boy and girl, and we're done. <laughs> we are done. But I, I need more money. I think it's actually like I guess interesting to see how you are with a girl. Like obviously you're amazing with trip. So like I feel like she's gonna like melt your heart. Honestly, yeah, she's gonna take all my money. Yeah, we had to pay for her wedding. Oh my god. <laughs> no, but yeah, it's we're really excited, you guys. Like obviously I have to learn how to do hair. That'll be. That. That There's so many part. resources out there now, so I feel like I'll, I'll do... My mom told Kira not to have her grandbaby looking crazy out here. She was like, I will literally fly down. I might just and do make her, her fly down on purpose just so she can be down here. <laughs> like, don't play with my, my, my granddaughter. And I understood, because you're not about to have my daughter out here looking crazy. Oh my god, I'm gonna do my part. But yeah, we're really excited, you guys. Yeah. Oh, oh, here, I'm oh, about sorry. to fall down on the couch. We're hoping she looks like me. Make sure we pray that she's chocolate and looks like me. Yeah, good luck. You know what's interesting? Oh my god. Both, all three, my oldest, my, bold, my older brother, my sister, mm -hmm. and me, all had babies with chocolate people. Yeah. And they chocolate all, woman. Yeah. And they're all. Well, not your sister, not chocolate woman. Uh, chocolate. Chocolate, man. chocolate man. Sorry. <laughs> yes. With chocolate people. Yeah. And they all come out um, pretty light. Yep. Pretty light. Well, no, because my older brother, he's not like light skin, light skin though. Yeah, he's like. He's like you know he's brown, browner than me. Anyways, we know she's gonna come out chocolate. And all the kids came out. Abruptly, his we're hoping really right. she comes out chocolate. But yeah, yeah, I would love a chocolate girl. That would be so cute, man. Mm -hmm. Yeah. But the way our jeans are set up, we'd never know. But I'm excited. <laughs> okay. I'm like getting ready right now. Um, I already got tripped together, so I just need to get myself together. I usually like to get tripped together first, just because like. He's usually a little easier and I just throw him on the bed and like he watches a little TV while he's on the bed so I can trust him there. Um, Cause obviously I do take a while. Well, I just lied. I don't take that long, but I obviously have to do my makeup and so like I'm touching like all kind of stuff. So I'm excited because we're gonna go to Pliable. And correct me if I'm wrong, doesn't Playa in Spanish mean beach? like? right like please let me know if i'm wrong but we're on a pliable and even though the weather is giving like fall for sure um because like 50s outside like high 50s um i know anthony and i've been talking about like going here and i think it's like national smoothie day or something so we are going to play a wool Yeah. <laughs> 